Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here at United States Dance Championships with no one less than Gary McDonald. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. And I have a big question for yes. you. The other day we had the Borum Show Dance Championships and I saw this amazing Mary Poppins number and I learned that you were involved in choreographing that. So um, I know you in very many capacities, so I want to know more about you as a choreographer because that was really a special number. Well, first of all, I'm glad you enjoyed it. Yes. Uh, secondly, it, it was a, a, group, a group effort. You know, it's like a, we have to have a good team. There's Diana and I and uh, Nazar and Mariko and um, also William Pino and Alessandra working on technical aspects. But um, together, um, you know, couples always come with an idea and a vision and then we try to like visualize what what it could be to so it looks the clearest when the couples come on the floor. A lot of times I watch a show dance and I have no idea what's going on, like what's the story? Yeah. And the couples are so like, they're so into it. And like, yeah, this is like, this means so much. And I'm like, well, I don't know, what does it mean? Yeah. And, and sometimes you just have to like hit people over the head with the idea and the concept so that as you're judging it, you're just enjoying the show that you know what it is and not until the last 30 seconds still trying to figure out what it is. And I'm sure you've been in that, in that situation as well. You know? Yes, many times. And it was also a very positive number and very happy number. Yeah. And that's really something very pleasurable to watch. Um, is that something you really love to do, choreographing, choreographing and, and creating or do well, you... You know, I, I love it, but not just happy numbers. I mean, there's intense numbers, sad numbers, but the key is the story has to be clear from the beginning. You know, um, one one that uh, I, I, I loved was Pasha and Daniela. We did uh, Pasha Pashkov and yeah. Daniela Karagach. We did the thing called a car crash. And yeah. she dies at the beginning, but it was so intense. But you have to, we did the sound of the car crash, the ambulance, the heartbeat. So you're hitting people on the head with the idea. I mean, obviously it's fun is always fun, but I like the challenge of getting, I keep saying the same thing, getting the idea across right away, because that's the key. Yeah. And then as soon as that's done, I mean, I, I think about half the short answers, I'm still trying to figure out what, what the meaning was. But that's somehow also true when you're in your general competition. Everything you do, every movement also has to, in a way, have a mean, mean something and have a connection. You know, because, five. yes. Give me five, exactly. No. Because otherwise, you know, it's, it's not watchable. It becomes a gymnastic exercise rather than an artistic expression. It, it has to be a reaction from me to you yeah. and you give me the reaction back and, and yeah. you, um, you're working off of each other and not just two, three, four and you know counting and, yeah. and, and being mechanical but um, and also too not being afraid to show how you really feel about whatever you're doing so your own personality comes out yeah. I you know we always go back to people our idols people like for me Marcus and Karen Hilton and Brian, Brian Watson and Carmen and each couple had their own individual thing going on, you know, and, and that's and that's what separated them from everybody else. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's really great insights. That really, really good insights. That was very interesting. I don't want to hold you any longer because okay. the competition is going on. Yep. And thank you for having some words with me. Thank you. Thank you, thank you so you. much. Ladies and gentlemen, here we are, United States Dance Championships 2023. Gary McDonald. Thank you guys.